Hello all C people, we're back with Rival Stars Horse Racing and we are breeding a barn full of golden horses. I've just bred, I've just bred this. I've just recorded this straight after episode one here because I need to get my content done. So um, I'm hoping that we can hopefully finish, well, I'm hoping we can finish the stable block in under five episodes. But what do you guys think? Hopefully it's not going to be a replay of the time we were breeding a barn full of black horses when it took us 14 episodes. Okay, so as you can see, it's still very expensive to skip these foalings, but I don't care. So Golden Princess, I don't know if she's, has she produced anything golden yet? You guys are more switched on than I am when it comes to stuff like this. So three, two, one, go! Right, let's find a foal. Chaps, let's do it. First foal of episode two. Oh my gosh, look at this. And a level 10 and a colt. Yes, Golden Princess. I wonder if this is the first Golden Fall we've had off her. I think it is, you know. And you guys need to put in the comments below a load of Golden names. At the end of the series, we're going to rename them all. And whoever's, whoever's name gets selected, you will get a shout out at the end of the series. That's what I've decided. I probably should have told you that in round one, but hey ho. Oh my gosh, he's gorgeous. Look at him, guys. Wow. Zeus did good. Yep, so this was these these foals coming through. If you remember from the last episode, which was episode one of Breeding a Barn Full of Golden Horses, you'll remember that I finished the video with Zeus being the stud because I haven't actually used Zeus yet. So let's go to Smoke Skeleton and see what we get. You ready, guys? You ready? Ho, 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 ho. And again. Yes. Oh, my God. I don't think... This might, we might do this in two episodes. Imagine that. Let's skip her to mare. Let's see how awesome she looks. Why are we breeding suddenly loads of Appaloosas as well? Where are these Appaloosas coming from? This is great though, honestly. This is so, so, so good. Look at this. I didn't think it'd be this easy. I thought breeding golden horses would be harder than breeding black horses, but clearly not. Yeah, they're pretty much identical. They could be twins. Apart from their face marking, of course. One last one from Zeus. Can we get three out of three? Let's go find out. Three out of three. Oh, not quite three out of three, but still. I know why he's producing this coat pattern now, because Eclipse is Zeus's mum. Eclipse was a blanket Appaloosa like this. Oh, cute. He's lovely. Look at him. He's gorgeous. We will sell anything that isn't golden, because at the moment we are going to start to fill up. Would you classify that as golden? It's more red, isn't it? That's definitely a chestnut. That's not, that's not a Palomino. Or a done type. So that's a weirdo elbow. <laughs> that's a horrible name for a horse. Do you remember Cobble Weirdo? I used to call him Cobble Wobble though. Because that's what came off the uh, the old lorry there on my brain. Okay, right. So who's actually subscribed to this channel? Make sure you do. I uh, don't want you guys missing out. If we get to 20k subs as well, I'm going to go live. I do actually know how to go live, believe it or not. Right, I'm selling anything that's not golden. Sorry. Cafe coffee probably uh, probably could have um, bred us Palomino or two. Spook Skeleton's beautiful show shimmer. Sh I can't say it still. It's absolutely stunning. Oh, it's going to be this so hard. I don't want to look at that. Do you know how hard it is to breed grey? Oh, we'll find out, shall we? And do a series on that next. Okay. Uh, Smoke Skeleton's gorgeous. I love this horse so much. I kind of want to breed her one more time with Zeus and just see if we get another... Let's just use Zeus again, actually, because that really worked well for us. And he's level 10, which means my snobby attitude of having level 10s, or should I say grade 10 horses, uh, is itched. Yep, it is. It is sorted. Uh, I love all these. I just love horses. Don't see many Palominos. I don't see many Palominos. I know they're getting more and more bred, especially the Cremalos. Let's go Raw Brain. That's going to be an interesting combo. That's going to be an interesting combo. I've got a good feeling about all three of these. Oh, so much money to skip, but good job I uh, prepared, wasn't it? Okay, Golden Princess, what have you got for us? Zeus again as the daddy. Oh, it's another one. We do breed a lot of these. Oh, cute. Level 10 cult. Which means it probably will breed some Palominos. If we keep him, set him as a stud. Let's do that. And then we can breed him with our Palomino mares. Next thing you know, 
bet you we'll have cool pat and palomino horses yeah we need to do breeding like tobianos and stuff like that that's a cool color when i did the uh horse quiz did you guys enjoy that I think it was good fun because I can always do some more horse quizzes if you want. It's mainly just for you guys. That's the only reason I did it. It's not for anything. I just made the video. Okay. So, uh, in a minute, let's uh, let's just use that one stand in a second actually while we're here. So let's use a decadence, decadence, <laughs> diaphragm. Oh, diaphragm. I know what diaphragm is. I'm a singing teacher. La la la. Uh, okay, let's um. Who are you related to? This is the question. Anything for Golden Princess, let's avoid. Are you related to Golden Princess? I don't think so. No, that's good. I think Days of Delight is, but uh, we'll ignore that. Character Calamity is gorgeous. Okay, let's go with that first one. I feel like there'll be a Palomino overload there. You guys were telling me your favorite videos are the Rival Star stuff, where we just breed random foals, so yeah. I'm on it. I'm on it. Have you guys seen the summer foals video? I did a video of breeding foals for the summer. I'll leave a link to that if I remember. Oh, yes. Oh, it's a little done, but it's cool. That's so cute. Oh, my God. That's probably the cutest one yet. They're all cute. I just I say that about everyone, but they, that is that is really, really special. That is super special. Let's give him stallion. Dance duck. Dance duck. Who dances? Oh no! Oh no, would you classify that as golden now? It's done the whole colour change thing. I'm not sure now. Is that bay? I might leave it in the stable block, see what you guys comment. Oh no, it doesn't look golden anymore. That looks more like a bay to me. Oh. Will it produce? That might produce a golden foal though. I want to go, let's go find out what decadence whatever his name is i can't spell all right uh with who's my breeding with it was with you isn't it let's go and discover his now and see if my theory worked might not didn't work <laughs> doesn't matter the foal's gorgeous but uh oh spaghetti oh okay whoops oh well we did all right there but you know da -da 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 -da. Skeleton blog. Who vlogs or blogs here? Does anybody vlog? Love vloggers. Conan and Liana. Never thought I'd be into stuff like that. They're flipping hilarious. Uh, me and my other half want to vlog. Oh, is that golden? It kind of comes across golden. I'll let you guys decide. Okay, I'm going to sell decadence. Ah, oh, decadence. Because I prefer that word. What's a decadence? That's like, isn't that what you can order at Domino's? Double decadence pizza. Sorry, Smoke Selection, you're absolutely stunning. Oh, why is this so, why, oh, don't. Why is this so hard? Like, why can we not have more stables? Why? Why? Do, 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 do. Stately March is a stunning horse. I don't think that's golden. That's definitely a babe. We'll sell him. Don't tell me how rare he is. I don't want to hear it, okay? It's like the time I sold Riviera, do you remember? I didn't know she was really, really rare. And you guys are like, she's really rare. And I was like... Oh. So what uh, other videos and content do you want to see? And can you let me know if you think Tuesday's Olympia and Granted Prawn... Prawn? Prawn? <laughs> prawn! Uh, should be in our golden. I think this one's definitely golden. Not sure about Tuesday. I think that could possibly come across a little bit as bay, but it does look golden-y to me, do you know? Do you know? Okay, we've got one last one here. I can't remember who the dad is because I have the memory of a teaspoon. Let's go for it. Mm. Oh my gosh, another blue one. I've got to call him blue. It's like a little gray blue type. I think he's a gorgeous. And he's coat. I love a coat. We can use him as a stud. If he has two palomino... Wait, is he turned palomino? Mm, does he count? I don't think he counts, does he? But I want to use him as a stud because he's got palomino... Uh, oh, 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 oh! Set him as a stud because I think he might produce some cool stuff. So let's go... Let's use 
Angel Atom as a stud uh, with some of our beautiful Palominos, like Fantasy Floatsome. That's a great name. So, yeah, give me your names, guys. Names that are selected will be completely kind of, well, what I like. But a bit random as well, you know? And then hopefully uh, whoever's names get selected for all of our 15 horses, uh, there'll be 15 of you that get a shout out, so that'll be well fun. Wanna... Cheetah's cargo is kind of very Palamine. I'm not sure. That's a folk horns. Change color. Uh, I'm not sure. Who are you related to? Let's avoid that. Raw Brain, who I totally just bred him with. Whoops. Just look away, guys. Look away. Hey, we've got three horses here. This is wonderful. Oh, okay. Cool. 20, do you reckon we can get to 20,000 subs? I want to be just like Abigail Pinehaven. I want to be as good as her. She's wicked. There's loads of good, like, horse people. Like, good gamers. There's loads of you. Some of you are saying I need to play rival... Uh, not rival stars. I'm totally playing rival stars. Star stable. But I'm pants at it. I need one of the other YouTubers to help me, but we need to facilitate that. Fantasy floats them. Let's go for it. Okay, really cute. And we're breeding loads of these. We're getting loads of Appaloosas. Appaloosas. I don't want any more Appaloosas. This is crazy. Da, 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 da. How many foals are we actually gonna breed today? So I'm hoping this will be under five episodes, but you know what? It's good fun, I enjoy this. But we're nearly completing the whole game though, guys. So keep your eyes peeled for that. I do have like a let's finish it episodes. So be careful of that. So we're nearly, nearly. It's basically how to complete level 20 at Rival Stars. So yeah, that's, um, I kind of don't want to breed with him again. That's the only thing. Who's your dad again, family's control? Yeah, let's use a random stallion with her. Let's use a Palomino stallion. Let's find a different one than other than Catastrophic Cat. Oh, I love a black stallion. Oh, there's a lot of grey in his family. It's funny, isn't it, what makes the colour on Rival Stars? It could be anything. I want a Palomino. It just makes life so much easier. Way here we go. Could produce a Palomino. Probably the cheapest one to find out. So let's, let's skip and find a foal now. Let's go for it. Oh my word, it's Dakota! <laughs> It's Dakota, everyone, with a bit of a wonky donkey face. Oh, the little, the face marking strange, but it's cute. It's basically Dakota. I haven't bred one of those in ages. Skipped a man. Woohoo! I respect gingerbread. I don't really like gingerbread. I'm gonna put it out there. Oh, cool. Okay. I wasn't expecting that. That's wicked. Lush. Lush, lush, lush. Hmm. Are we gonna? I don't know if that will produce a Palomino. We could try. Should we put her with Zeus? That could be a weird combo because they both got the same patterning. Let's put her with something that's got like. What did I want Dance Duck for? Are you Stalin? Yeah, let's set him a stud. Yes, use Dance Duck because he's got two Palomino family. Like parents. So let's breed him with that one we've just bred. Fussy Foghorn keeps changing colour every time. <laughs> oh dear. An amazing glitch happened yesterday. Look at Fantasy Floats. She's my favourite, I think. Let's see what this combo produces. You never know. Mm. Really weird glitch yesterday where I was trying to get a picture of like the family, you know, with the mare, the stallion and the foal. And it was like, I'd gone to take a picture of, say, like, Cheesecake, the foal. And it was a different foal. Like... It was a really weird glitch. I thought, oh, that's new. Raw brain. Oh, I'm really sorry, but we totally inbred you, I think. Uh-oh. At least it's a golden horse. Oh, it's gorgeous. Hey, it's that coat pattern as well. Super duper duper. Yeah, so if we look at the family tree, if we... Let's careful for a second. Let's take a picture of these guys. Oh, it's with that stallion. It's kind of cute. Hmm. 
Yeah, she looks so nice. So she's got really cool coat patterning and she's level 10. But if we look at her pedigree, we might see some parents in there twice. Yeah, whoops. Whoopsie. Let me just breed her with something and try and breed that out a bit quick. Let's breed her with that random, like, Palomino stallion, actually. We've just found. We'll breed her with something random. Hang on, let me sup my back. Guys, I'm getting so old. Can I just recommend any type of uh, gaming chairs? It's a very boring conversation, I know. But, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go to Sublime Smoke. She has produced... I don't know. I don't know what how many she's produced yet. If anybody could tell me that, that'd be wicked. How many golden foals has this horse had? Oh, it's another Dakota. Why is this coat coming through? Gorgeous. I'm not complaining. That is a gorgeous coat. It's not golden. Is it because of Zeus? Let's just skip to Mara a second. Ideal truffle. That actually kind of suits her, the name truffle. I'm so hungry for truffles. I didn't realise pigs ate truffles. I thought truffles were genuinely chocolates in the ground that pigs like dug up <laughs> and another one i thought silk was actually from spiders not from a silkworm as a 10 year old child told me the other day i couldn't believe it um i love this mare i think she would produce if we breed her with that random stallion we found she could produce something really cool so why don't we do that and just see what happens i don't know how many stables i've got left that's the only issue here Oh, we could always sell that one if we needed to. Let's go with, yeah, let's go with this combo. There's hopefully no inbreeding going on there, then. Um, who are we gonna find out first then, chaps? Chubby chop chop. Okay, let's go to the respectful gingerbread. Stupid name. Oh, cute little bay. Mm. Okay, so maybe our theory about the uh, Panamina hasn't come true. sell a horse oh no if it's not golden let's sell angel atom oh no we might have to do a bit of a flush again look at the coat pattern in that horse there is something really cool going on there and you just can't see it that's what's annoying we might be able to breed maybe his grandkid or something will breed the coat pattern fingers crossed but what are we going to name all these horses i need names for golden horses that's what i need i love our new outfit Chorus confidence. La 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 la. Let's sell you. I don't think that was ever going to produce a uh, Palomino, actually, thinking about it. Bye bye. He's had a nice life. He's going off to a lovely, nice home. Let's sell. Oh, I don't want to sell this because I think it's really nice. But let's sell the gingerbread. Oh, no. It's, do you know, there was a time where that was so rare, that coat pattern. Then I ended up breeding it like thousands of times. Two of the foals on the way. I'm being a bit harsh, actually. I'm being a bit harsh. Big meanie. I'm teaching in approximately an hour. This is crazy. Thanks to yesterday's microphone. Deciding it didn't want to work, which is great. Actually, I just want to check it is working now, because if it isn't, I'm going to probably cry. I think it is working. Ah, oh, thank goodness. We'll see. Technology. Cool. So, how many have we got now? One, two, three, four, five. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't count these three because we started off with those, but so we did have five, so we have got four more in today's episode. So that that that's pretty good actually. I'm pretty chuffed with that. Sherbet, I love Sherbet. It's like Oh, I don't have a stud set. Oh, okay, let's do this Palomino one. Who do you guys want to see bread with who though? I'd like to know. I do love Raw Brain, but we need a new name for Raw Brain because it's a horrible name. Okay, let's discover these three foals. So let's go to Artifact Sherbet. Is that like an old Sherbet? Ideal truffle. Lots of food stuff going on here. If we wait six, five, four, three, two, one, boom. Oh my gosh, look at the colour of it. Oh! <gasps> It's like a giraffe! Oh my word, that's gorgeous. Please, is it a mare? Is she a mare? Oh, it's a colt. Okay. Kind of would like to, to have been a mare. It doesn't matter. Oh my gosh, look at it. 
Look at him, he's beautiful. That's a very strange colour. We've definitely not had that colour yet. Not, not with me, I've not bred that colour. Unless you guys know I have and I forgot because I have the memory of a teaspoon. Let's breed him. Yes, with all of our Palomino mares. So let's go and find out what ideal truffle has now. Then we'll do that. Oh, she's bred another one. Oh, that was really cute. The way they stumble. Brace your heart. Okay, what do I do with myself? Breeding a barn full of golden horses. Skip to my melodic centipede. Have you guys known any centipedes to be particularly melodic? Oh, I love that shade. I love that. It's like a grey bay. Actually, a grey bay is when you have a grey that's minging, right? Oh, we'll keep her in case. We'll see what happens if we run out of stables. Run out of stables. But let's use. How do post posturies? I don't know how you say his name. I'm scared. Uh, so let's go. Oh, I just find this one more out. So raw brain is a very very strange color. She's kind of this like faint dappledy, and she has bred us quite a lot of golden horses so far. So I'm hoping that she'll be able to breed us something cool. Let's go for it. It's loud. Oh, strange, but really cute. Oh, it's nice. It's a little chocolate bar one. That looks like a chocolate bar to me. That's really cute. So skipped mare, fabulous. So if there's any weird noises, it's probably neighbor's cats or it's uh, next door doing the garden still. Oh, wow, that's a really strange color. Look, that looks like chocolate when it's gone off. And that's really mean, but you know, like if you ever had an advent calendar and you looked at the chocolate and you were like, that doesn't look right, you know? <laughs> this looked like pedigree and it's a mare so this could this probably would as well produce some cool stuff so i want to use this new stallion though because he's out of this world cool looking how do you say his name Poster posterities posterities i don't know what it means uh let's breed him with just straight palomino horses because i feel this is going to be a good, this is going to be good. I mean, look how cool he is. Yes, he's not Palomino, I know. But, I like big butts and I cannot lie. But, he's got two Palomino families. So, you know, let's find something that's got Palomino parents a second. Let's go into character calamity, see what you've got. Two Palomino parents. So, let's go for that. Kind of solve that one. Great. Oh, my word. Fantasy faults them. She's gorgeous. That's so cute. So cool. I love this. So Cheetah's Cargo. So to make this series a little bit longer and more fun and to see if we can do this in under five episodes, I think I might leave it there today because we've done this surprisingly quick. We really have done this surprisingly quick. But let me know what your thoughts are on Tuesday's Limpet especially. Does that count as a golden horse or is that more of a bay? Looks golden to me. But then, you know, I'd like your opinion on that. But look at all these guys. Starting to get some real cool looking horses. Palominos galore. So we'll probably sell anything that isn't Palomino, which would lead us with how many stables? Only five stables. Depending on what these foals are we're about to produce. So, yeah. Is he going to produce some golden, gorgeous babies? He's got... He's got quite a lot of Palomino in his family tree, so... If we could breed that coat pattern in Palomino... That'd be amazing. <laughs> that would be literally incredible. So let's just go and take... Let's go on to Troublesome here a second. I absolutely... I love this game so much. I was getting a little bit, like, sick of it. But now I've got something to focus on and enjoy. I wonder what I could have for golden. Like that, that'll do. We need Golden Princess in the middle, really, but... Oh, I love them. We need something that shows all the goldenness. Yeah, that's kind of shades, like, it goes down in colour, right? Let's take away the overview. I think the overview sometimes models it, you know? Let's get some little photos. They're so cute. I love the Cromello. He's been my favourite so far, I must admit. Uh, any other combos here that would work nicely? Let's go with that. And then another light colour. That's kind of cool. 
Uh, yeah, that's cool. Let's go with this one as well. They're pretty much the same horse, them, though. Yeah, that's a cool combo. Okay, that will probably do it. But yeah, I, I'm i really chuffed with today. I feel like that was good, you know? Cool. Good. Episode two of breeding a barn full of golden horses. We've got five stables left and that is it. We have three foals on the way with a brand new funky stallion. So yeah, I think it's gonna be good. If you guys haven't subscribed, make sure you do because you don't wanna miss out on what's happening on the lady ranger channel we are arranging for the best horse games that's my plan anyway um i will find some new ones i've got a few new ones in the wing if you know what i mean i've got i've got some stuff coming out so yeah you don't want to miss out on that if you haven't turned your notification bell on guys you can physically lose me and also uh sometimes youtube can kick you off it so make sure you check you you're still on you're still on the bell and if you've enjoyed the video then please give it a have a wholesome day. Thank you so much for all your support, guys. I really honestly appreciate it. You're all fabulous. Bye.